This is Dr. Kevin of Eye Associates of South Texas. I'm going to show you a toric intraocular lens implantation that we did last week. You can see that we've just marked the cornea with the uh, purple marks on the uh, superior part of the cornea. You can see the mark on the left. This is where we're going to align the toric lens. The mark on the right is the marking of the horizontal meridian. You'll see now we're injecting in the toric intraocular lens. This one is made by Alcon and you can see we're injecting it through a uh, Monarch injector with a C cartridge and you'll see that the intraocular lens we're going to place in the capsular bag with a Sinsky hook and you can note that the capsularexis is smaller than the optic of that intraocular lens. This is ideal as it allows good capture of that lens implant. You'll see on the toric intraocular lens there are markings, there are those three dots on the superior screen and the three dots on the inferior part of your screen on the uh, optic of the intraocular lens. These will we, we will align with the previously marked cornea um, and this is the axis of the maximum astigmatism. This intraocular lens implant corrects corneal astigmatism. This is important as a third of the population have more than a diopter of corneal astigmatism that gives them poor vision postoperatively without glasses. This lens allows patients to be less reliant on glasses after the surgery. You can see we are hydrating the wounds with balanced salt solution. This will keep the wounds uh, what we call stromally hydrated or slightly thickened to um, let the surgery be carried out without sutures. You can see that we are removing the uh, viscoelastic, that's the special material that keeps space during surgery, and we are positioning the lens implant in the correct orientation. You can see those three dots are perfectly aligned both on the superior and inferior part of the optic with the previously made corneal markings. This patient should have excellent visual acuity without glasses for distance as we selected this as the patient's target for better vision. You can see again that the capsularexis surrounds and holds that intraocular lens implant in great position. This is Dr. Kavanaugh of Associates of South Texas. Thank you for your attention.